Hey everybody, I'm back. I was always asking here and I'm back. So, uh, oh shit. And, uh, if y'all don't know, uh, some people do, some people don't. I'm a big fan of Kingdom Hearts. I always have been. My favorite character is Riku. If you know, I'll show you. I got my profile. Pick for a kick. Let me show you. Hold on. That is my profile pick for kick. You don't know who that is? That is Riku. Right, I'll push so you can see it better. That is Riku. There's my profile pick. Yeah. And uh, another thing. I got a Keyblade necklace, if you can see it. Right there. A Keyblade pendant. I don't know which world, what it's called, but I know what world it's from. It's from uh, uh, the number for Christmas, the Tommy Town level. Yeah. Because it has a little snowflake right here. If you can see it. And it's a key. It's a keyblade inspired from the movie I Remember for Christmas. So I guess it actually beats that level. Well, anyways, what I'm gonna do here is that I have I have written a fan fiction for Kingdom Hearts. Yep, here it is. I'm gonna read it to y'all. <clears throat> the Kingdom Hearts fan fiction is called Kyrie's Heart. Okay, so I'm gonna start it now. You know. <clears throat> Riku was sitting on the beach in Destiny Island after defeating Sainort, wondering if it was all worth it. Then up walks Kyrie. She asks if she can join him. He just nods, and she sits down. After a right while, Riku says, Kyrie, can I ask you something? Kyrie nods the answer. After all this fighting and defeating Sainort, for the third time, this is supposed to be after the third one, third game. <clears throat> and yeah, you and you know that I am a much better fighter than Sora. He is, by all means, all means. How come you haven't picked the guy to be with you? Yeah, that's a good question. That's plagued everybody. Okay, let's see. Oh, Kyrie, Kyrie was about to answer, but was interrupted by Riku. He says, um, I know Sora shared a Papu fruit with you, but I'm the one that told him what happens when you share one. Kyrie got a surprised face. <clears throat> Look on her face. Like, like she knew she, she was Riku. Kyra was about to confess her feelings for Riku, to Riku, but ju just then, Sora walks up. Hey guys, what's going on? Sora says. Riku just looked looked back at the ocean straight ahead. Kyra got, got a sad look on her face. Sora sat down. Oh, I see how it is. You guys are talking about me, huh? Sora says. Does everything have to be about you, Sora? Riku says. <laughs> I like that. I just love that. I'm, I wrote this, by the way. Well, I did fight Heartless, Nobody's, Unverse, and the organ Organization 13, he, he said. So I said. Okay. Yeah, and I helped. With all of them. Why do you think they were so easy? Well, you were fighting them out here. I was fighting them in the darkness, Riku said. Yeah, he was. If you pay attention to, this, to the stories, Riku was fighting him in the darkness before they came out. So think of that one. I'll get back to the story. Then Riku says, shows who's a better fighter. Sora gets mad. Gets furious. Stands up and summons the key, kingdom key. You're going to you're gonna saying that, Riku, he says. Sora goes to strike Riku with his keyblade. Then Riku summons his and knocks Sora back. 
we could someone stands up and uh walks to Sora. Rico was about to strike Sora while he was down. A carry got between them, shouting Sora. Oh, oh, I see. I knew you'd pick him. Riku said and begins to walk away. I'm not picking anyone. Not yet, Harry says. Riku turns around and says, what do you mean? What I mean is, for me to pick one of you, you guys have to go, have to do a series of tests, Harry says. Tests? Both Riku and Sora say. Yeah, three tests to be exact. Three. One of strength, one of stamina, one of loyalty. Selfie helped help, help me pick these out. Help how to put these together, Harry says. Okay, let's get get on the tests. I know I'm gonna win, says Sora. Wait! Wait here, guys. I gotta get a selfie. She'll help me decide. Says Kyra. Kyra leaves get a selfie. While she does, Sora and Rico wait. Kyrie comes back with Selfie, and Selfie says, About time, Kyrie. I was wondering when, who you were going to pick. Then Selfie says, Okay, Sora, Riku. <laughs> she giggles. These three tests will help Kyrie decide who she should be with. First test is strength. Basically, you just have to stand up to an endless horde of heartless. Nobody's in numbers. As Selfie keeps talking, Sora says to Kyrie, How could you do this, Kyrie? I shared a Palpu fruit with you. Yeah, about that, Sora. Riku says you gave him the idea, Kyrie says. Sora gets mad. Oh, he is going down, he says. And suddenly, they're both in a black, endless void. And suddenly, heartless, nobody's, unverse, and unverse appear. They... Start fighting him. It was a long fight. Then Sora collapsed. The heartless nobodies and unversed were about to pounce on Sora. Just then Riku saw what happened. He left and, and, defe and defeated them before they got to Sora. After three hours of fighting heartless nobodies and unversed, Sora and Riku find themselves back on Destiny Island. But not just Kyrie and Selfie were there. So was Mickey, Donald, Goofy, Waka, Titus, Leon, Yupi, and Aaron. So wakes up and sees them and says, What are you doing here? We're here. We're here. We heard you guys were going through couple of tests for Kyrie's heart. By the way, good work for the, on the first one. First test, Riku. Leon says, give me a thumbs up. Wait, y'all knew for the whole time, Riku says? Yeah, it sounds so romantic. About time, Kyrie, says Yuffie. Oh, okay, Sora, Riku, get ready for the next test. This test is about stamina, basically a race, a race to close a keyhole. And along the way, you will fight many heartless, nobodies, and numbers, and this time, dream eaters. First to get to the keyhole and closes it wins, Rico says. Then so we can find themselves in a dark, unlighted path, background aligned with buildings from the number was level in Kingdom Hearts 2. With Heartless, Nobodies, and Unverse, and Dream Eaters awake to strike. On the trail to strike. A butter sounds, and Riku takes off like a bullet, running. While running, Riku looks over at Sora and says, I bet you wish Donald and Goofy were here, huh? Sora doesn't respond. Get, just gets mad. Just then Riku summons his keyblade, leaps up, and slashes through the heart of the heartless, blasts through the nobodies, and crumbles to 
converse and devastates the dream eaters. Then make, makes his way, makes his stance, and blasts a beam of light into the keyhole, and then the keyhole was locked. Then they got transported back to Destiny Island one more time. Only someone was missing. Where's Kyrie doing? Uh, Rico asks. Oh, that's the last test. It's loyalty. In this test, Kyrie got kidnapped by Ansel the Seeker of Darkness. We must rescue her, says Selkin. Easy. Done it before I could do it again. Down, Goofy, then Selfie interrupts Sora. Uh, that's another thing. No help. By yourselves, Selfie says. I get that done, Sora. You didn't have help in the last two. What made you think we'll, we'll have help in this one, says Riku. But also, like in the other ones, in this one, there will be heartless and nobody's unversed and dream leaders. You think it would be that easy, Sophie says. Honestly, I thought it would cross my mind. Riku says. Next thing, Sora, Riku, and Riku are in the realm of darkness. Off in the distance, Riku sees Kairi tied up and runs toward her. Then, heartless nobody's unverse and dream leaders come out of nowhere. And Riku blasts um, with when he first sees him, then slides over to Kyrie. He starts to untie Kyrie. Then suddenly, Anson, Seeker of Darkness, jumps out of the shadows to strike Riku. But Riku jumped out, jumped back. Welcome to back to darkness, Riku. Anson says, Anson, Seeker of Darkness. Riku got in the fighting stance to fight. While he, this is going on, Sora is still fighting the heart. Heartless, nobody's unverse in three meters. And so he goes to strike Riku, but Riku dodges it by sliding under him and strikes Ansem's ankles. Then Riku leapt up behind Ansem and struck him with a downward thrust from his keyblade, killing Ansem. Then the chains around Kairi's Wrists and ankles disappear. Riku catches her and Kairi hugs him. Sora just got done with the Heartless. He turns around and sees them hugging. He gets sad and falls to his knees and hangs his head. They get transferred back to Destiny Island one more time. Sora is still on his knees and sad. Riku and Kairi are still hugging. Just then, Kairi surprises Riku. Then Riku kisses back. Everyone cheers. Selfie walks up to Riku and Kyrie and says, Well, I see you you, you picked Ky you picked Kyrie. Congrats, Riku. You have won Kyrie's heart. Then Riku's keyblade glows and the eye of his keyblade is replaced with a small pink heart with R a symbol plus plus symbol K engraved in it. It made Riku kiss Kairi more. Sora is sitting on the beach, on his knees, sad. Took out the papu fruit he had shared with Riku, all, I mean Kairi, with all those all those years ago. Then Mickey, Donald, and Goofy joined Sora. I'm so sorry, Sora. I guess you can't wait a moment. But, but I bet there's someone out there for you, Mickey says. There's no one out there for me. Not like Kyrie, Sora says sadly. Then he gets up and throws the papu fruit into the ocean and runs away. Mickey looks at Donald and Goofy. They shrug, and Mickey looks back to the sadness. The end. Well, that was my fan fiction of Kingdom Hearts. I call it Kyrie's Heart. So if you liked it, you can rate, comment, subscribe, and you can find me on Vine. Got some good stuff on there. So and I'm so yeah. I'm Ashley Rasmussen, and I am signing off. Later.